Here's a quick introductory video to the party selfie case. Um, it's really, really simplicity itself to use. Um, it's powered entirely by internal batteries um, and it's simple as pressing two buttons to, to get it to work. So um, has this selfie ring light here, which gives you, you know, better lighting. It's got this little uh, NeoPixel LED that uh, attracts people to look at the lens for the camera, which is actually right in the middle here. You can't see it, it's, it's tiny. Um, there's a screen here for uh, display instructions, and then there's these two buttons to control it. So to get started, guess what? You press the green button. So press the green button, and then you choose which layout you want. You can either do one photo, or you can do three photos, which it will stitch together. The three photos takes a little bit longer than the one photo because there's a bit more processing to be done by the computer. Um, I'll do the three photo now just to give a demo. So press three photos and it says, let's go. And what it's going to do is uh, remind you to look at the camera, not the screen. A lot of people do look at the, the screen. We get a, a countdown before it takes the first picture and then Flash is taking it, then it does another countdown of five seconds. I'll just put my arm up just to show it's different. And then I put the other arm up for the third one. It's five seconds between each one. Then it stitches the photos together and it will display the resulting picture. And we can put a, a little message on the pictures. So there we go. Uh, we went to the Science Museum Skills Fair and three photos stitched together. You can either forget the photo or press the blue button to print the photo. That screen times out after a few seconds, but you can still, you now press the green button to start again, or you can press the um, blue button to print. Now if I press that, it should automatically, so I can see there's one print in the queue there. Hopefully this thing will spring to life very shortly. And this is a, a little dye sublimation printer, so it prints the colours separately. Is it going to print? And here we are. So it prints out, as I say, three different colours separately. It prints the yellow first, so it all looks yellow. And the printer's battery operated as well, so um, that should last for quite a while on the battery. It can plug into the mains if we need it to. There's the uh, magenta. And then the last one is the cyan. And there we are, there's the finishing print. And there you go, we went to the Science Museum. So that's a little takeaway for them. Um, that's it, I hope you enjoyed the demonstration.